Neonatology last minute flashcards. You are able to review these cases in the pediatric board study guide, neonatology section, last minute review, chapter 33. Newborn infant has just been delivered and the infant is apneic and has heart rate less than 100. What is the next best step? Positive pressure ventilation for 30 seconds, then reassess. In the previous example, the infant's heart rate dropped to less than 60 beats per minute despite adequate ventilation for 30 seconds and mask adjustment, reposition airway, suction mouth and nose, opening the mouth, pressure increase, airway alternative. The best next step in this case, chest compressions and continue PPV or positive pressure ventilation using 100% oxygen. Newborn with a round hairless area, yellow orange color with velvety surface and slightly raised. What is the most likely diagnosis? Nevus sebaceous or nevus sebaceous of Jadison. Newborn infant with head swelling crossing the suture lines. Delivery was assisted with use of vacuum. Another one, newborn infant with head swelling does not cross the suture lines. This is a case of cabot saxidinium crosses the suture line. This is a case of cephalhematoma doesn't cross the suture lines. Newborn infant with respiratory distress. Bowel sounds in the chest scaphoid abdomen. Bag mask ventilation after delivery made the infant worse. Chest radiograph shows loops of bowel in the chest, mediastinal shift, paucity of bowel gas in the abdomen, and the presence of the tip of nasogastric tube in the thoracic stomach. Diaphragmatic hernia, key words, respiratory distress after birth, bowel sounds in the chest, scaphoid abdomen. Bag mask ventilation will make the infant worse. This is contraindicated. And on a chest x-ray, you will see the bowel loops in the chest. What is the next best step in the newborn with diaphragmatic hernia in the previous example? Intubate immediately after delivery. Insert a nasogastric tube to decompress the stomach. Avoid bag mask ventilation. A full term in you born with missing middle three fingers. Amniotic band syndrome. Cocaine used during a pregnancy can cause that. What is the current recommendation for umbilical cord care in infants born in developed countries? To keep it dry and clean. Use of alcohol is no longer routine cord care. Having trouble or trying to pass the pediatric board exam? We have the definitive solution for you, presenting the Last Minute Review Series, a powerful tool for achieving success in pediatric board exams, crafted by Dr. Osama Naga, a board-certified pediatrician by American Board of Pediatrics and the editor of the Pediatric Board Study Guide, a Last Minute Review. Dr. Naga breaks down the most critical subjects in this series. The Pediatric Last Minute Review webpage offers a thorough and rigorous set of pediatric board review sessions that are in line with the study guide. The lectures will cover the most important topics for each condition that a pediatrician must know for pediatric board exams, as well as real-life clinical encounters. The inclusion of a clinical case scenario, accompanied by multiple choice questions, followed by the most probable answer and a comprehensive description of the issue, will ensure test readiness for each student. You will be able to download the lecture's PDF files to make your studies easier, to take notes and be accessible on the go and offline. Based on the membership plan you choose, you will have unlimited access to the lectures for either one month, three months, six months, or one year. By viewing these videos, you will increase your chances of passing the board exam and gain substantial advantages from the acquired knowledge. Additionally, by studying the material and completing the AAP prep questions from the previous three years, you will greatly increase your likelihood of passing the board and will acquire a wealth of knowledge. Click on the link provided below to visit lastminutepediatric.com and subscribe immediately. Be sure to take advantage of our free video samples on our YouTube channel, Pediatric Board Last Minute Review. Good luck with your exams. This is the end. Thank you.